Breaking news tonight. The U.S. and Canada closing their borders as the coronavirus pandemic deepens. New shelter-in-place orders as millions more Americans are told to stay home. The Navy to deploy two hospital ships, one to New York City. The U.S. toll rising over 130 deaths. Cases globally now topping 200,000. President Trump calling himself a wartime president. The dire predictions from the White House expect a dramatic increase in cases in the next four to five days. And just in the Senate passing an economic relief bill. And those checks for American families, what we've now learned about when they could go out and for how much they might be. The Dow nosediving again. All the gains during the Trump presidency wiped out. Is your money safe? The crisis at hospitals, the first hospital in the U.S. dedicated to treating coronavirus and rising concerns for health care workers on the front lines. The dramatic new warning for young people still crowding beaches and bars. They may be more at risk than we knew. If I get corona, I get corona. At the end of the day, I'm not going to let it stop me from partying. The growing pleas from health officials, the online crush as more Americans work and learn at home than ever. Can the Internet handle it? And what you can do to boost your speed? And the new alert for parents tonight about the coronavirus and young children. This is NBC Nightly News with Lester Holt. Good evening, everyone. We're glad you're here. With the touchstones of normal life vanishing before our eyes, the Senate late today approved the first interventions for Americans caught. Turn to our team now for the latest.